I never thought I'd ever go to Paris and we're here and this is the way to soak it in. So I gotta wear my backpack this way because I don't wanna get jacked. It's hella sketchy over here. There's a lot of things going on, a lot of people, so I gotta wear my backpack like that. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. How have you been feeling in Paris? I've just been feeling really tired. It's been tough. It was still a rough flight. I had to get up every two hours to walk around, so I didn't really get to sleep. Lately, my stomach has been feeling crazy, so I guess it's just a part of the growing pains. Uh, it just feels weird, so I don't know if it's just stress from traveling, too. It might be. Yeah. What we'll do is we'll enjoy some good brunch right now, Yeah. then we'll go to the museum, Musi de Ose. Yes. I think that's how you say it. I'm not sure. If we have time, we'll hit up the Eiffel Tower during sunset, but we also have to take a nap before that happens. Probably. It's okay. I don't know if I can manage, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, it's okay. okay. I already planned in the nap for our schedule. <laughs> okay. Okay, so let's go eat. All right. Okay. I think it's called hake. The hack. Yeah, hack. It looks good. Oh, so What tender. is that on top? I'm not sure. I'm gonna break a piece of. Oh, it smells almost like curry. Oh, pretty good. It tastes like fish with curry. <laughs> I got the beef cheek. Any place in, in Paris is not really known for their beef because we've had it a few times. And it's, but beef cheek is what people are known for out here. So I'm gonna try this beef cheek egg roll type that thing. That looks interesting. And, uh, you gotta dip it with that sauce. All right. Ooh. Mmm. Oh, that's pretty good. It's like a softer taquito with some like yogurt based sauce. Ew. It's really, really good. pretty crazy we just finished lunch feeling a little nauseous I feel yeah. like our appetites kind of weird the food is good but I feel like I can't really take it in because right now when we eat lunch it's actually about 3 in the morning in LA yeah. so I think our body's not used to that and it's making me a little nauseous when we eat these full bold meals and we're not used to the flavors either and yeah. it's kind of exotic to us yeah it's a big change let's walk it off Eat some uh, croissants. The croissants. The croissants. And then we go to the Monsieur de Leveux. The, that is the museum behind us. And they will have, what do they have here? They have a lot of architecture, painting, landmarks, it's just a little bit of everything. And they have the Mona Lisa here. Oh. Yeah. But there's gotta be so much more. All right, well, let's go check it out. All right. This is crazy. In the museum, everyone comes for this right here. The one and only Mona Lisa. That's awesome. All right, about to have dinner with everybody. Oh, that stuff looks crazy. All the rare meat, look at that. So sorry, Boo Boo. My hormones are out of whack, so I just want to tear up every time I see something I can't hey, eat. We already knew this before we came here. It's hard. We knew that you were going to be able to eat a lot of stuff. I know, but it's hard when it looks so bomb and it's like right in front of your face. Uh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Can I get some balsamic vinegar, please? Look at that, that's so crazy. It comes out like a spray. Look at him rubbing that in my face right now. This salami smells delicious. for you. I'm so sorry. Oh, thank you. You're so sweet. Ooh. 
That's a nice flavor. Mm. That's wow. That's like the perfect smoke cured taste. Can I eat it if it's hot? I, I think you can if it's hot. Is that pepperoni? No, it's not pepperoni. This is like beef jerky right here. It tastes like uh, jerky. Board, board, board. 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 Mm. Yeah. That's good. Really? That truffle is really good. It doesn't look as good, but it's pretty bomb. Risotto never looks good. I know. But what did you get? Linguini with clams. Most clams look really fresh. I'm about to try it right now. These clams are good. Oh, yeah. She's one half to cancel. Damn, look at that. Going down with the clams. Alright, so this always happens. We always trade food because the thing that I order is always better than what she orders and she ends up always stealing all my food. Isn't that right? That's not true because I'm so limited on what I can order and then I was thinking about this too. But he's already getting it so I was like, okay, what else, what else can I get that he would like? And he always likes to get like we need clams. So I got something that you would eat too. Well, I actually got it because I figured you could share it with me and that's why I got that one. Or else I'd be getting something with some soft cheese that you can't eat. You know everyone's full when they start slumping. You know, this guy slumped over, Joe slumped. Julia just, she's totally out of it now. I'm so ready to knock out right now. He did not work with I'm so ready to knock out. He's so good. He said, what's your dessert though? Dessert, I want to try the pan butter. Yeah, it's hazelnut ice cream with a nougat, and it's weird because the hazelnut looks like it's vanilla. Whoa! Wait, is that cream? No I think so. I'm not sure if it's ice cream. So That's pretty bomb. No, it is ice cream. It's such a different ice cream. Wow. Because it's not cold or anything either. It feels like it's cream. Yeah, it does. Wow. How was your meal? It was delicious. Yeah. We killed both of our plates. And it's raining right now, too. Oh, it's raining in Paris. It is. And we just packed summer clothes, too. Yeah. What you doing? Rubbing the belly. Yeah? Yeah, because she keeps moving around a lot now. She's really active. She's just like doing flips or something in there, but I, I feel it. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Can't wait to meet you. Me too. Four more months, baby, till we get to see you. Four more months. Yeah. You can't see me, but I'm, I'm petting you right now. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Got to meet up Joe and Jess today. We're trying one star Michelin restaurant called Benoit. Ah, we're excited to finally try some good stuff. Yeah. I hope I get to eat everything. I yeah, know. there is some foie gras in there that you probably can't have. I'll eat it for you. Yeah, yeah. we'll eat it for you guys <laughs> or for you. Can we just tell them to cook it more? I don't think you can tell Michelin star to cook it how you want them to cook it. No, okay, no. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> I know. It's the baby talking. They're gonna, they're gonna start <laughs> crying. I know. I don't care if you're pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this thing that I just saw right now. Look how cute it is. Ooh, for who? For the baby girl. Oh, it's like frozen. They ripped it off. Yeah. How does the song go? <laughs> let it go. Let it go. Shante, I've got like Lisa. Elsa. Oh, this is Lisa. Oh. Oh, Elsa. Elsa. <laughs> oh, don't say Elsa. Sorry. You should have put a French twist on everything. I don't know. I don't know the names so of the baby frozen girl, girls. If you see this you footage, will. Daddy can't read. Good morning. Good morning. Who is this celebrity right here? Mother Michael. What up, guys? What's up? Good morning. The hey. man of the hour. Why wow, you're dressed so nicely? This is this is Paris. Where? Paris. I, I, I ran out of clothes to wear, so I'm wearing the same thing as yesterday. Already? We've only been here for <laughs> yeah. like three days. I mean, cold clothes, cold clothes. Oh, yeah, cold yeah. clothes. Yeah. That's yeah. I have so many shorts. 
sitting on your first Paris bench. Yep. What's the difference between Paris and LA benches? Well, look at it. It's missing this whole center part. Oh. There's like no back part. Oh, I didn't notice. So kids can't sit there. Ah, uh, they could. They just might fall through. And then there's some pee right there by someone. I'm sure it's from the rain. So one thing that was weird for this trip was that when we were packing for Paris, it was about 80 to 90 degrees every day when we were looking it up. And since we've gotten here, it's rain. So it's really cold. We pack shorts, we pack shirts. I'm freezing and I Are have, you? I have a cardigan and a cardigan on. I keep wearing leggings. All I packed were dresses and you I have to wear this stuff because every day. this is like my sleeping shirt because I don't have any other clothes. Yeah, yeah, it's time to try the tasting menu. Yeah. Excited, huh? I am, but I'm also nervous because I'm like, oh, I hope I get to eat everything. All right, we got you the good marinated sea bream. Yes. And what happened? So we asked them if it was cooked and they said that it was. But if you look down at it, it's not cooked at all. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even seared or anything. No. It was a complete sea bream carpaccio. Okay. Alright, and what we got over there? Okay. Pick pork trotter. Pick pork trotter, trotter yeah. Pork trotter. In oh. a bread. Oh, this looks good though. Look at that. Oh, it's in there. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, okay. oh that's good. Alright, this is my second time having escargot. The first time I had it, it was actually really good. But the second piece I had was way too big. So I've learned to not get a big piece. So I'm gonna try this little baby one here. Yeah. Make sure to Careful. Yeah, just keep <laughs> I'm your having hands. trouble. Ooh, this is hot. Make sure to drip that butter on there. Get out. Get out. Alright. Okay. Here we go. This smells delicious, though. Mmm. That's actually really good. My snaily is Yay. Good experience. Yeah. We're at a one Michelin star. This doesn't. This shouldn't happen at a one star Michelin. And, and it's perfect. <laughs> it's supposed to be good. So if you see everyone else's dishes, theirs came out very presentable. Beautiful. Jenga styled up, racked up, Beautiful. apple slices, and uh, mine was destroyed. But Aww. this thing right here is the uh, pork sausage with blood intestines. Things that I don't usually eat, that's what you eat. But, but it was recommended by It was recommended, and I'm going to try it. Oh, it smells good. It just tastes like shredded pork with a sausage kick to it, which is okay. pretty good about that. Can you taste the pork blood? No, I think it's all fried. Oh, that's good. Yeah. Awesome. To finish off our one Michelin star lunch, we have fruitcake. It's an apricot fruitcake, sorbets of raspberry something something. I don't remember. And we have vanilla, chocolate, and coffee. Oh, and chocolate. Uh, just our specialty. Oh, oh wow. thank you. Wow. So we have vanilla cream and oh. vanilla ice cream. Do we dip with this? Absolutely. <laughs> Oh, yeah, wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wow, this looks crazy. Mm. Was it cheese inside or? There's a cream puff. We're gonna walk to the Eiffel Tower. And it actually feels really good to walk right now. It feels great. The breeze feels good, the air feels good right now. But now we're walking towards the smokers at the cafe. Look at this. That's a lot of people. Oh man, I didn't know every person in Paris smokes. Crazy. And we're back to the loop. Here we are at the Eiffel Tower. Look at this thing, it's gigantic. It's it's huge. I didn't think it was gonna be this big. And I didn't think there was gonna be this many people. And it looks so shady, so sketchy. Look at all this that's going on. It's just so sketchy. Everyone's selling stuff This is stuff when here. people tell you, hey, you need to hold on to your bags and watch out for your stuff because people are gonna try to take your stuff, so you gotta be careful. And I get it now. Oh, look behind you. Oh, it's the military. Yeah. Wow. I never thought we'd be this close to the Eiffel Tower. This is, I never thought I'd ever go to Paris and we're here and this is the way to soak it in. So I gotta wear my backpack this way because I don't want to get jacked. It's hella sketchy over here. There's a lot of things going on, a lot of people, so I gotta wear my backpack like that.
Good morning. Bonjour. Not Bonjour. even morning anymore. No, it's late. So Way late. It, it's been really hard with this jet lag. With all this traveling and all this sightseeing, it's a bit much for this prego right here. And everyone decided to go to Versailles today and we decided to skip out because it might be a little too much for her Too many people and yeah, I just want to take it easy enjoy our little baby moon that we got going on here So today we're on our own while everyone else is doing that. We'll probably meet them up for dinner. It's Gina's birthday tonight Yay, Happy, Yay. Birthday, happy Gina. birthday Gina, so we're gonna go meet them up for dinner for right now We're just gonna go eat lunch. Yeah, and yeah. we're gonna eat at the same place again with the foie gras yeah. Ravioli It's bombs. Yeah, I'm excited. That's our favorite meal of the trip so far. All right, so now we're gonna go eat. Baby is so spoiled right now. She had escargot twice. Yeah. Like, no, three times. Yeah, almost so every day. So spoiled, I know. What baby gets to do that? What is it that you're eating right now? Shepherd's pie with duck. Ooh. It looks delicious. That's a lot of cheese on the top. Oh, wow. Ooh, it looks hot. Ah. <laughs> ah. Ah. It's so good. It's like um, duck and mashed potatoes. Oh, really? Yeah. What is this little thing? Let me see. What is that? It's like a little squaw. Oh my god. What is the butter for? I don't know. Maybe to put on meat? your meat? I was hoping to get like some salamis and uh, a bunch of sliced meats, but it all came in chunks. Yeah. So it's kind of interesting. lunch we did some shopping and we actually tried to go to Luxembourg Garden but we didn't make it yeah we were actually just trying to look for some stores just to go look at but we ended up finding a mall of yeah. all places and we just got stuck in there for a while and we kept stopping at other shops now you bought too much stuff you bought a lot of stuff no, my favorite thing that I bought today was not even at this mall it was uh here hold this I got this guy right here, which is a French knife. It's a chef knife made in this place right here in this region, Goyen Chazot. They don't even know that's how you say it. I wanted a new knife that's specifically from Paris or from France. Bro, this wood right here, it smells legit. Ooh, I can smell the wood right when I open the package. Let's see this. Smell it? Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. It's a very strong wood smell. And I'm actually very glad I went with this one. So it's between this or a Wusshof. The Wusshof is from Germany. And I'm not trying to buy a German knife out in France. I wanted to buy a French knife. When was the last time you bought another knife? A we crazy went to expensive Japan. knife? Yeah. We went to Japan. We bought a Japanese knife. You're the one that should be happy because I'm going to be using this every time we cook. The baby's going to be happy too because you're going to be cooking for her. Oh yeah, she's yeah, lucky. Yeah, lucky girl. So lucky. I know. I guess now uh, let's go meet up Gina and everyone else. Yeah. Hey, uh, Thank you, honey. <laughs> I love your outfit. Thank you. How was Versailles? Should we go inside? Happy birthday! Thank you! <laughs> We still have some extra bone marrow left right there. Uh, we're gonna put mix together with there and theirs. Oh, and then this is the sauce and the mushrooms and veggies and potatoes from the chicken. Yeah. 